our primary colors of red, yellow, and blue to make our color wheel. Hi, sixth graders. We're going to go ahead and color the color wheel. And you're going to get a cup of crayons with your primary colors, red, yellow, blue. And we are going to start with yellow. And we're going to color yellow. red orange and blue green and I know you're thinking but yellow is not blue green and yellow is not orange or red well these colors have yellow in them so we're gonna color all three colors and then when you get done with all three colors we're gonna color yellow orange orange because they have yellow in them. And we're gonna color green and yellow green, because those colors also have yellow in them. So yellow is in half of the color wheel. Now we're gonna move on to red. So red, is in orange. Yellow orange has just a teeny tiny amount of red in it. Lightly, lightly. And that if we go across to blue violet, it also has just a little bit of red in it. Lightly, lightly. I'll put L's here for just a little red. Then orange has a medium. So orange has a medium amount of red. So I'm gonna push just a little harder with my red crayon on orange with red. A little bit more. And then I've got some heavy hitters down here. Violet, red violet, red, and red orange. All of these colors have massive amounts of red. So I'm going to put an H for hard. Color hard on these. Lots and lots and lots of red. No matter how much red you put on red or orange, it's still going to have an orange tone because it's got yellow behind it. There we go. Okay, now we're gonna go to yellow-green. Yellow-green has a little bit of blue, just a little, and then we're gonna go straight across to red-violet, and red-violet has just a little bit of blue, little, little, little bit of blue, And then green has a medium amount of blue. So yellow and blue make green. And then I've got four more areas that have tons of blue. That would be violet down here. It's got lots of red, lots of blue. Blue violet, blue and blue-green. And I just broke my crayon because I color kind of hard. So, lots and lots of blue on violet. Yeah. There we go. Lots and lots of blue on blue-green, blue, blue-violet, blue and don't remember, don't forget, Violet. All right, now we have made the entire color wheel with just three crayons, red, yellow, and blue. Amazing. Well, now that we've done the color wheel, we're gonna use uh, some 
first you're going to color the primary colors on the next page. Next, you're going to take and color yellow where the orange would go, yellow where the green would go, then you're going to take blue and color it on half of the purple and half of the green. and red colors on the yellow for orange. Purple is red and blue. Warm is yellow, orange, and red. Cool is blue, green, and purple. Neutral is brown, black, white, and gray. Okay, so if I have yellow and I'm using analogous colors, yellow has orange on one side, green on the other. So now I am choosing to color my first house yellow, and then you guys can choose what color you're going to color with it. 
which analogous color? So you've got green or orange. Colored house is going to be orange. And orange has two neighbors as well, two analogous colors. So orange has yellow on one side and red on the other. So I need to pick what analogous color I'm going to color with my orange house. So my next house color, I'm painting it red, and red has two neighbor colors on it, just like the other one. So red has orange that lives beside it and purple that lives beside it. So I need to choose, am I going to do red with orange or red with purple for this last, for this analogous house? Then my next house, I'm going to start by coloring it purple. And purple has two neighbors, two analogous colors, just like everything else. It has blue on one side, red on the other. So I need to decide, am I going to color it blue with purple or red with purple? My last house is going to be blue. And blue has two analogous colors. It has green on one side of it, and it has purple on the other side of it. So complementary colors are across from each other like yellow and purple, green and red, orange and blue. When they mix they make brown, but when they are side by side they appear bright. So we're going to color our first circle yellow and overlap yellow with purple. And then we will get brown. Then we're going to color our next circle Blue, nope, I take that back, green, 